everyone, John Chow here from JohnChow.com and welcome to another episode of Driving with John Chow. Uh, yesterday, uh, something interesting happened, a very, very rare sight, one that I don't believe I get to experience. YouTube was down. Yeah, YouTube went down yesterday for over an hour and generally uh, you don't think that can ever happen, you know, a site controlled by Google, uh, the biggest site in the world. Uh, yeah, Google, the biggest site in the world. YouTube, the third biggest site in the entire internet. Going down for an hour, that is like really, really insane because uh, Google accounts for over $10 billion of revenue to, I mean, what am I saying? Yeah, YouTube. <laughs> YouTube accounts for over $10 billion of revenue to Google. So, the fact that YouTube went down for that hour meant that Google lost over a million dollars. Um, <laughs> when you figure the number, it's quite insane. But uh, I figure I would use this uh, YouTube outage as a reminder about making sure your business, your website, and your life has a backup plan. Uh, too many, uh, so many people. Don't think about that. Internet marketing, are you going to start a blog? Are you going to start a YouTube channel? Are you going to start something? And you don't think, well, what will happen if, you, if, your landing pages, if your landing pages go down? What happens if your blog goes down and you lose the information? Then you're screwed. And they don't think about that until after it happens. And that, that's really the sad fact of the matter. Most people don't think about a backup plan until after disaster strikes. So... Uh, I would want to find recommend when before you start you know, when you start you know you set up your you set up your foundation and you set up your blog you set up your landing pages you set up your sales funnel but have a backup to your sales funnel like how, if if you have an email list when was the last time you downloaded that list when's the last time you downloaded that list because you may say oh it, it's on Rayweber it's on constant contact it, it's protected but okay it may say we up there but what if and this has happened before what if you get a few spam complaints because somebody who thought, what do you get this for? I didn't sign up for this when he did. And they they, 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 so they did complain. Thing is, if you hit a certain threshold of spam complaint, the provider will just delete your account. They'll, they'll just shut your account off and won't give you access to it. And I had that happen to several internet marketers. They said that, and they said, oh, they said, oh my third provider just shut my account. I can't, I can't go download my list anymore. And they don't have a copy. So guess what? They just lost the entire list. They're screwed. Right? So uh, every once a week or after or more or whatever frequency you want, you should download a copy of your list. And once a week, you should download a copy of your blog. You should you know, back up everything. It, it just, it's, it's just good practice, preventative maintenance, so to speak. Right? So in case something else happened, you're protected. You won't. You won't. Be, you won't be screwed. You won't be screwed. Uh, for my blog, for my blog, I, I use a, I use a service called uh, uh, what was it? It's, it's by WordPress. It's by WordPress. It's called VoltPress. It's owned. By, it's created by WordPress. It's called VoltPress, and they automatically back up my blog on the fly. Like in, like when someone makes a new comment, it's backed up like on the fly. And every hour, it makes a full backup every hour on the hour. So if something happens to the blog. I can restore it an hour ago, two hours ago, three hours ago, whichever one. Like if I get attacked, I have a malware hits or something like that, I can find the, the closest clean copy, restore from that point. And instantly we start having it back up. And it's happened to me before. And that uh, by having this, you keep service disruption to a minimum. And you also prevent what could be catastrophe. Something really, really bad happening, right? And so... I have a backup plan. Obviously, Google, YouTube had a backup plan because they, they were back up in an hour. I mean, considering how big the site is and how many servers they're running, how many employees I think is employed, they, the fact they got back an hour is, is impressive. And actually, the fact that they actually hardly ever go down ever is, is impressive as well. And, and they have plans to do that, obviously. But, uh, you know, it could, be, it could be a lot worse. So always have a backup plan. And not just, not just for your business, but backup plan for your life. And it, it's... it's it, I find it almost heartbreaking, really, to find that I believe 40% of America 
have less than like a thousand dollars in in emergency fund. Like uh, it's a forty percent of America. If they have hit with an unexpected one thousand dollar bill, they would be in big big trouble. They would be in big trouble. So in other words, forty percent of America is living paycheck to paycheck. So basically, if they something happens to their job and they don't have a backup plan, they are majorly screwed. <laughs> so backup plan for your income stream, right? Like if you like, this is why I have multiple income stream, multiple ways of making money online, multiple ways of making money, just making money. Because if one of the, if something one of them gets hit, backup kicks in and I'm okay. Right, so one of my income stream gets hit, I'm okay, and uh, you know what? And they have so my income stream has been hit before, but I have backup. I keep developing new ones, and this is what you gotta do. And unfortunately, for most people, uh, their, their income stream is their job. One income stream, no backup plan. Uh, a one thousand dollar bill would severely affect a lot of people. Uh, loss of the job, a loss of one paycheck would put them in a financial bind. So, don't put yourself in that situation. Don't put your business in that situation. Create a backup plan. You don't have one, and add more income stream. You only have one. Add more. All right. So uh, a good reminder from YouTube. A good reminder from Google. The fact that they went down. They always when something like that happens, I'm reminded to always reevaluate my backup system to make sure it's all up to date and that kind of stuff. And you should do the same thing. John Chow and JohnChow.com. Thank you very much for listening. Give me a thumbs up if you like that. Please like and share my video. If you're, first time, if you're a first time viewer, please subscribe to my channel. It does help me a lot. And I'll see you guys on the next episode.